Hello everyone and welcome to the Canadian Redneck Channel. My name is Dave and today we'll be continuing our assembly of the 444 International Engine. Um, we're going to put in the lifters and the cam and timing gears and time the engine. Um, I'll set the camera up so you get a view of what's going on and we'll get started. I've numbered the lifters uh, according to where they go from front to back in the engine. Uh, I use a paint pen that uses water soluble ink that way you can wipe that off because you don't want anything that could be abrasive in there wearing on the lifters or the cam. So we'll get the paint wiped off and put them back in place. Before you put them in the block, good idea to put a little drop of oil on. Once we get our oil can, there we are. ready to put the cam in the block now so the first thing we'll do is give it a good coat of oil on everything and then we can start sliding it in through the front I really couldn't find any way to make the dots show up on camera, but on the crank, oh yeah, great, on the crank, there's one dot here, uh, yeah, one dot in a valley between the teeth here, and two dots in a valley between the teeth on this side. The cam has one dot on a tooth. That lines up so the dot on the tooth matches up with the dot on the valley on the crank. To dot. And then we'll have to turn this a little bit so we can find our bolt holes. There we are. There's one. Okay, you need to locate the proper bolts for the cam. They're a shallow headed bolt, uh, about half the thickness of a standard bolt head, and they have a kind of a star washer on them. And we line our marks back up and now we'll put our other line marks in line for our idler gear that goes here. And I forgot to mention these marks will line up in the proper spot, top dead center on number one. We're now ready for our idler gear. The idler gear has a small roll pin dowel right here and it fits in a hole in the block right here. You gotta make sure you line those up. And then our teeth we have two dots on the crank here, two dots on a tooth here, one dot on the other side. The one dot on the other side of the idler is to line up with your injector pump gear, which we will get to later. So like I said, we need our teeth to line up here and the dowel pin to line up over on the other side. There we are. We get our teeth lined up. There, so now, and it's lined up. Torque specs for this bolt call for 75 foot pounds minimum. Uh, I set my torque wrench for 78, and we'll tighten it up. There we 
we go. Let's get our engine timed. So that was installing the cam and lifters and timing the engine. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, any questions or comments, you can leave those in the comments section below. Uh, as always, like, subscribe, share. Have a great day.